Many conditions can affect the normal function of the thumb. It is important to recognize the most common conditions so appropriate treatment can be given. Estenosing tenosynovitis, we call it trigger thumb. One of the more common conditions of the hand, especially the thumb, is called trigger thumb. It is associated with painful triggering or locking of the thumb. When the patient tries to straighten the thumb, the nodule jams beneath the pulley proximally. Another condition called extensor pollicis longus tendon rupture. The tendon is responsible for extension of the thumb, especially the distal interphalangeal joint. It occurs usually with fracture of the distal radius that are not displaced, and when it happens, the patient will not be able to extend his thumb. Entrapment of the posterior interosseous branch of the radial nerve. The posterior interosseous nerve is continuation of the radial nerve that runs through the forearm. The nerve passes through the two heads of the supinatal muscle. The nerve becomes entrapped at the proximal edge of the supinator. The injury of the nerve can also be associated with fracture dislocation of the radial head or the elbow joint. The patient will be able to perform wrist extension but no finger extension. Here is a patient that is unable to extend the wrist or the thumb due to a proximal radial nerve injury. Number four, unable to do the OK sign due to anterior interosseous nerve injury. The anterior interosseous nerve comes from the median nerve just below the elbow and supplies the deep muscles on the front of the forearm. This is a typical pinch attitude with nerve injury. Typically, there will be weakness of the long flexor muscle of the thumb, the flexor pollicis longus, and the deep flexor muscle of the index and the middle fingers. Number five, injury to the under nerve, from and sign. The cubital tunnel syndrome occurs due to compression of the ulnar nerve at the elbow. As a result of the cubital tunnel syndrome, the patient is unable to cross the fingers or abduct the fingers. So what is the Froman sign that affects the thumb? When you pinch a piece of paper or use a key between the thumb and the index finger, the thumb will flex if the adductor pollicis muscle is weak. Rheumatoid arthritis of the thumb. The inflammation or irritation causing pain, swelling, weakness, and over time loss of normal shape and alignment of the joints of the thumb. The deformity can lead to loss of the ability to grip, grasp, and pinch. The most common deformity called boitinaire deformity of the thumb. 